On this series, we've had adventures by train, by bike, on foot. But today we're going out on the water on a stand-up paddling adventure for the environment. Alexa Barton got into stand-up paddling as part of a recovery from a spinal injury following a bad ski crash. The gentle movement in nature proved good for her body and her mind. The freedom is, is incredible. I feel especially being on the water and wherever it is, whether it's on the lake, whether it's on the sea, whether it's the, the river, the opportunity, the possibility to, to get out into nature and really be immersed in and on the water, it brings this feeling of living and, and real connection back to myself and to the water. While she feels the beauty of nature has given her so much, Alexa wants to give something back. So she organises plastic waste collections on the water where volunteers borrow stand-up paddle boards for free and help her collect the rubbish that gathers in the lakes and rivers. The idea was inspired by Britain's Lizzie Carr, who set up a plastic patrol to gather the rubbish she'd seen. I was seeing this every single time I was out on the water. It was awful and I needed to to show people what I was seeing, take the problem to them and understand this wasn't just a global issue and it wasn't something that we could disconnect from. It was something that was relevant to every single one of us. The plastic in our rivers and lakes will eventually reach our oceans and add to that massive global problem. But for Alexa Barton, it's even more personal than that. For me, water is life. We are 90% water. This earth beautiful earth we're living on is called the blue planet for a reason we're all connected and so this cleanup is on a, on a deeper level than that <laughs>